Today I'm going to show you how to make crumpled paper mock-up in Adobe Photoshop. First open your quick selection tool from the toolbar. And click and drag over the paper to select it. Now press Ctrl J to cut the paper from its background. Let's name it, Crumpled Paper. Then right click on it, and convert it to Smart Object. Go to Image. Adjustments. And open your Levels window. Drag the two top left sliders to the right, to add contrast. Go to Filter. Blur. And Gaussian Blur. I'll make the radius, 5 pixels. To save it to your folder, just go to File. And Save As. I'm going to name this, Displacement. And from this drop-down menu, choose PSD file format. Then press Save. Now delete this Smart Filters. Then from the toolbar, select the Rectangle tool. And click and drag to draw a rectangle. Drag the opacity slider all the way to 30%. Right click of this shape layer and convert it to smart object. Press Ctrl T to free transform. Right click and choose the distort. Now use these corner handles to distort the shape and match it to your papers. Press Enter on your keyboard. Double click on this and rename it Place Drawing. Go to Layer and create clipping mask. Now double click the thumbnail to place your sketch drawing. Just go to the file, place embedded, and place your second image. Adjust the size and position. Hit enter once you're satisfied. Let's go back to the file, and choose save, and then close the document. Now go to filter, distort, and displace. I'll make the horizontal and vertical scale, 10. The displacement map, stretch to fit. And the undefined areas, wrap around. Then press OK. Open your displacement PSD file, that you saved earlier. And change the blending mode of this layer from normal to multiply. Click the FX icon and choose the blending options. Hold the Alt key, to split the white slider, and drag it to the left. Then press OK. Now make one copy of it, by pressing Ctrl J. I'll decrease the opacity all the way to 50%. Then go to Layer. And create Clipping Mask. And that's it for today. Thanks for watching.